In this video, we'll showcase three improvements related to element drawings. This video is for Vertex BD users who do frame design. You can now use height symbols in element drawings to indicate a point in the height position as in section, view and facade views. Open the element drawing, select the view to which you want to add the height symbol. Within the right mouse button is a context sensitive function that allows you to add a symbol. The height icon of the element drawing follows the default settings of the project, where the relative height or absolute height is displayed. This update is now available for you in version 27, so take advantage of it. Next, we look at how to display grid lines in an element drawing. By presenting grid lines, the location of the element in the building can be located. The wall element displays perpendicular grid lines that are at or near the element. Horizontal structures do not matter in relation to the direction of the grid lines with respect to the element. All lines at or near the element are displayed. It is possible to add many grid lines to a building. Therefore, the user must choose which grid lines to use. It is done with a tool that can be used to determine the visibility of external parts in the element. In addition, in the element drawing, you select in which view the grid line is displayed from the view properties. In the element drawing, you can edit the module line and its symbols in the same way as in the 2D design view. Next, I present how to make pipe components appear in the element drawing. Element pipes are connected to the element as external parts. To do this, you can find its own function in the element selection bar. I select the piping parts that are part of the element. Visibility is adjusted in view properties. The pipes appear in the element as a separate layer. The pipes appear in the element view as in the floor view with the settings according to the pipe type. You can change the line properties on a layer by layer basis if you wish. A list of parts can also be added for piping parts. To add it to the drawing, select add list view and list type and place it in the appropriate location on your drawing. 